Hello my dear students, in this video we are going to study applications of stacks. Stack is used to reverse a word. It is used in undo mechanism in text editors which we have already studied in the previous video. Conversion of decimal number into binary number system. So here this one we have already studied in the PU1 class to solve Tower of Hanoi. Here Tower of Hanoi is the data structure which you are going to study in a higher classes expression evaluation and syntax parsing so this mechanism comes in a compiler while converting the source code written in high level language into machine equivalent language conversion of infix expression into prefix and postfix expressions in this video we are going to study in detail about infix expression prefix expression and postfix expressions Quick sort. This is one of the sorting mechanism in which we are going to arrange all the elements in either ascending or in a descending order. Runtime memory management. Let us continue with arithmetic expression. Here expression is nothing but it involves both operands and operators. Arithmetic expression consisting of total five different operators. The first one is plus operator next one is minus operator and then multiplication operator which will be denoted as asterisk symbol and then integer division which will be denoted as forward slash and then percentage symbol that is modular division next we have got three different types of expressions that is infix expression postfix expression and prefix expression so let us continue with the first one infix expression infix expression means if an operator is in between two operands it is called infix expression let us take an example a plus b where a and b are the operands and plus is the operator let us take one more example here a plus b inside the round braces multiplication c minus d multiplication e here a b c d e are the operands plus multiplication and minus are the operators Next, we will continue with postfix expression. If an operator follows the two operands, it is called postfix expression. Let us take example. Here, A plus B infix expression can be written in the form of postfix expression as AB plus. Because the plus was in between A and B, it has come onto the right hand side. So, here both these operand follows this operator. Let us take one more example a plus b into c minus d into e this infix expression can be written postfix as here we have written a b plus because we have to evaluate the expression which is present in the bracket first we need to bring this out onto the right hand side we remain with a b and then plus so that's the reason here we have written a b plus then the next expression which is enclosed within the round braces we have to write c d and bring this operator onto the right hand side, it will become CD minus. So here we have written CD minus. And after that, we have to evaluate from left to right. So while evaluating from right, left to right, we have to consider this asterisk symbol that is multiplication symbol first. So this one will come onto this place. So here it has come. Now this multiplication will come onto the right hand side of this e so that's the reason after e we have got asterisk symbol that is multiplication symbol next we'll move on to prefix expression if an operator precedes two operands it is called prefix expression means the operand before operand will be having one operator here you can see the example a plus b infix expression can also be written as prefix as Prefix means what? Before the operands, the operator will come. That is plus AB. Next, we will take the same example to write the prefix expression. AB, that is A plus B into C minus D into E. This infix expression can be written prefix as. You can see here, first we have to give preference to the expression which is enclosed within the round braces. So, here we need to bring this plus onto the left hand side now. So, here plus AB then we have to give the preference to this expression which is enclosed within a round braces we have to write minus cd because this minus will come onto the left hand side so here you can see minus cd and after that we need to evaluate from left to right so first this multiplication will come so it need to be jumped from 
this place to onto the left hand side so here this asterisk symbol will come and from scanning from left to right this asterisk symbol will encounter so this particular asterisk symbol will come onto the left hand side so he, here it comes okay next we will continue with algorithm for infix to postfix expression so this is most important listen to this carefully the first one is if it is operand output it if it is operand operand could be variable or it could be constant and of course we are going to take one example if it is opening parenthesis push it on stack if it is opening parenthesis we need to put it onto the stack next if it is an operator then if stack is empty push operator on stack if the top of stack is opening parenthesis push operator on stack if it has higher priority than the top of stack push operator on stack else pop the operator from the stack and output it repeat step 3 next if it is a closing parenthesis this is most important you just listen carefully if it is closing parenthesis pop operators from the stack and output them until an opening parenthesis is encountered pop and discard the opening parenthesis we need to discard the opening parenthesis because parenthesis are acting as operators but we should not consider them in a expressions if there is no more input pop the remaining operators to output so this also we are going to consider in a forthcoming example now let us have an example suppose we want to convert 2 into 3 divided by 2 minus 1 plus 5 into 3 into postfix form let us write three columns the first one consisting of expression second one is stack and the third one is output let us continue with writing the expressions from left to right first we are going to write in an expression 2 then multiplication symbol next 3 next division next round open brace 2 minus 1 brace plus 5 into and then 3 here we are going to follow all the rules given in the algorithm so let us continue with the stack for the first time stack is empty next output is 2 when the expression consisting of operand then it has to be outputted that is the rule of the algorithm next is operator so this operator has to be pushed onto the stack next the output will be 2 only again we are going to encounter with the operand 3 so this one has to be outputted it will become 2 3 so once we got the next operator so the operator which is present in the stack is to be popped out so here we have got division it has to be pushed into the stack here multiplication will be popped out after 2 3 here you can see 2 3 multiplication symbol next is open brace division and open brace open brace will be pushed into the stack now the result is 2 3 asterisk symbol so next we have got the same operators in the stack but here we have got operand 2 so this one is to be outputted that is 2 3 into and 2 will come so here you can see 2 3 into 2 will come next minus sign so minus sign is to be pushed onto the stack next the result is 2 3 into 2 once we encounter the closing brace so this particular operator has to be popped out but here we have got the operand 1 so this one will be continued as it is here you can see 1 is the operand which is directly outputted and the stack remains the same next we will encounter with the closing round brace once we encounter with the closing brace all the operators which are present in round open and closing brace must be popped out that was the rule you just go through once again yes okay so here the minus sign will be popped out 2 3 into 2 1 minus okay next we will encounter with the plus by popping out the division here you can see 2 3 into 2 1 minus and 
division so plus is stacked and next one is 5 5 is the operand it has to be given in a output so that is 2 3 into 2 1 minus division and 5 so next is multiplication symbol so this multiplication symbol is to be pushed into the stack you can see here plus and multiplication the result will be 2 3 into 2 1 minus integer division and 5 next we will encounter with the operand 3 so here once we got 3 it has to be outputted so here you can see 2 3 into 2 1 minus integer division 5 3 so once we come to an end because here you can see we have come to an end the operators which are present in the stack is to be popped out first this multiplication will be popped out and then this plus will popped out here you can see the result as 2 3 into 2 1 minus integer division 5 3 first asterisk symbol then this plus symbol will be popped out and then the stack is empty that's all in this video thank you very much for watching this video we will see you in the next video